Ready? I'm 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 ready. <laughs> you ready? Doctor? What are we performing tonight? Okay, put on my Okay, I'm ready. Okay, I'm here for safety here. You have you have the Fitbit on? Yeah, I could be doing at least a thousand steps. Maybe you, I doubt that, but. you like my gloves? I like my, I like my gloves. They don't stay put. Mm. And then I gotta put on my apron so my shirt won't get dirty. I don't want it to get dirty. So what? At 10K Diamond. Diamond mm. made the shirt for me. Oh, okay. Diamond, who used to um... work with yeah. me? Oh, okay. Pre COVID. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, pretty cool. Anybody come in here? Shut your fist. Got spatulas and oxidants. Oxides. Oxides and strainers and tape measures. I don't know what it's Is that on? Yes. You can't see over there. These aren't reading glasses. These are just don't get blind glasses. So today we are making Brooklyn and um, this is one of the wholesale bars. It's the only fragrance bar that's part of the wholesale line. But it's a popular fragrance for me, anyway. It's a dupe of Coco Mademoiselle, which is a perfume by Chanel. But it's unisex, because a lot of men like this fragrance, and I don't really can tell them it's a woman's perfume. So I have it in the soap, I have it in the body butter, a lotion stick, and a scrub. That's how popular the fragrance is. So, this is the Brooklyn. Brooklyn. So we're going to add, I'm going to strain my light water because there's a bunch of goop hanging in it. Probably didn't have the container cleaned all the way. So I don't want that in the soap. For this mold. The calculations at all other websites was not working. So I'm just stirring it because this is a big pot. I'm just stirring it to try to get a little emulsified before I hit the mixer with it because this puppy right here is powerful. And my other stick blenders sink down in here so this has a longer shaft. The girls hate when I say shaft. Salt. 
and it helps the soap release and harden up quicker. that are going to get colored with the mica and activated charcoal. That is whew, the white. It weighs a lot. So I want to start mixing the lighter color first, which is white. So this is going to get white. And I mix my titanium with glycerin. And this is going to get white. Isn't the, the mm. black mixed separately, like the titanium? Hmm? Like the titanium. Why am I mixing separately? No, the black you just put in the uh, the thing. Oh, Out of the I don't pre-mix that. Oh, okay.
stir that up. It's just that. I just picked up a whole bunch.
consistency is I like to do swirls on it because it doesn't get muddled. Looks like some cool art. <laughs> What's that guy? Pollock? Mm. Yeah, I think his name is Pollock. But this inspiration for these colors come from I have to book my boss at this hotel in Boston. And this is the colors in their lobby. This
can feel the heat coming off of this. The, the lights? No, like the soap. It's heating. It, it's heating up. That's how it forms. So it goes through. It's what's called saponification. big bowl big mold but I still want it to have my look so if I just left it flat that's not really is 99% alcohol. I get it from Amazon. And what I did was order a gallon and just keep refilling this one that I got from CBS. 